Okay, faintly, faintly, back again here at Supermarket Simulator. Um, early access version. And following on from last time, we've just expanded our shop a little bit, but it's given us this really awkward little nook here. So I've just done a bit of a rearranging to get all the stock on this wall. I mean, we are covering a door there, but that's not in use at the moment, so that's fine. The main idea being that I should be able to see all my shelves at a glance and see what is in stock and what is not. So I might just finish adjusting a little bit. I have this cashier here, that's a bit easier. Keep some stuff behind me. That. And uh, when I order stock, I will use this space, I suppose, until we need it. I've got $690 and I need a bit of everything. So once again, to start, I'm just going to get basically a box of everything. Onto the street, in front of the traffic. Some things might need two boxes. And we'll just make sure everything is stocked up nicely. Now, I still don't... I'm waiting to buy the next license, which means I get a lot more stock. Um, as in, I get more things to stock, I should say. And I've been leaving those shelves mostly empty until then. But I was wondering how far away that is realistically. So I'll, I'll just think about that because um, as soon as I buy that license to sell more stock, customers are going to demand it. And if they're demanding it, I need to have all of it basically. Which means another two shelves full of things that I need to worry about. Which is fine because I do have a little cashier helper here. But the customers will still just sit there and ding the bell at the empty register. Even if I'm out stocking shelves and he's available, so... Need to keep that in mind. I don't like that there, actually. No. Uh, eggs, milk, tea... What else do I need? More coffee, more flour. Did I just load up the wrong bread shelf? I think I did. Uh, more coffee, more flour. Purchase. Leaves me with three hundred dollars. And yeah, so I did unlock this storage room, which is a bit of a pain because it's so out of the way. Um, oops. So I figure why not just use this really unlock space in here. The shop's a little bit messy, but I don't think anyone really cares. Well, I will if it's uh, if I didn't know it was only temporary, I would care. Some eggs. What a great looking kind of shop, is it? <laughs> well, I can reach that. I can run it here easily enough. What have I got in here? Got oil, pasta, more bread. I'll just take that now. Just make sure I've paid my bills. All installments are paid. All bills are paid, that's what we like to see. And I need to be level 20 to unlock the next cashier. I'm only level 13 at the moment, so I've just got to keep selling this stuff. And hopefully the next day, I will have enough money to potentially, buy the next license, stock some new products here. But anyway, we are open for business. 
I just realized the light switch is behind this shelf. Which I didn't think through. Yeah, this is awkward. <laughs> this is an awkward layout. Now I'm wondering whether I need to save up for another extension pretty quickly. $1,300 though. I'm assuming it'll hollow out this corner. I don't know why I did this instead of just giving me an extra meter or two. It's just that this big awkward chunk. Anyway. Yeah, now I'm wondering whether I just need to fill these shelves with existing stock. I should let them empty this out. Reserve these for the new stock only. Do I have a... I do have a loan, don't I? Yes, I'm still owing $500. I was thinking, do I just grab another loan? Buy the license. Expand here. It's a bit scary to have that kind of outlay all at once. Now I'm paying wages, I'm paying two loans off. Plus all the new stock. But then again it might be necessary to grow. Card 28, thank you. Uh, what is that loan going to cost me? $173 a day. I'll extend it. $20 day loan. That's a lot though. I'll always try and pay it off early. Okay, flowers are running out. Doesn't take long. People love their flower. Three bags of coffee. Maybe some for everyone else, mate. Bit more coffee, didn't we? A twenty-seven. Thank you. And twenty. Do I need? Still, I need to buy more flour, oil, and pasta. What's pasta in here? In this storage room, I invested in and now just ignore. Maybe I can put the cashier in there. <laughs> Just send people outside. What could go wrong? Oh, I'm finally getting used to the fact that there's no dollar coins. This feels wrong. Uh, dollar notes. On the card, what's that? 44.50, thank you. I'm going to order some flour, I'm going to order some pasta, some coffee. Be 
antique shop, 55, thank you. Uh, pasta, flour, coffee. I'm actually going to get two of each of these. They seem to just fly out the door. Look at that. Can't keep the shelves stocked. Milk, six change, nope, 94 change. Yep. Certainly do need to invest in some better lighting. I think I mentioned it last episode, I'm wondering whether I need to start thinking about having more than just two spots per stock item. But once I get the new license and new stock, I'm going to need this room. Wait and see. Cereal. Top up the coffee. Is that parcel looking? Yep, already threw those two boxes of parcel that I just bought. Already threw the two boxes of flour. All of a sudden, I'm back to no stock again. Forty-one, thank you. Nine dollars, thank you. All right, it's nine o'clock now. End of the day. Thirty-eight satisfied customers. I buy for 750. Oh, that was the extension. Yeah. Um, still have a healthy balance. Water and coffee is down. Eggs are up. Up those to five. Coffee's down to nine dollars, let's say. And water. That can probably say the same. Okay, if I pay my bills. And rent. That leaves me with a thousand dollars. That's good. We're growing. So, am I ready to expand? I, I just don't think so. What does it cost? Four hundred and fifty. Let me see what it. All right, I'm gonna stock up on all the basics. Yeah, I'll stock up on everything that I've already got and make sure there's plenty of that and then see how much is left for potentially licensing and holding new stock. Because I don't want to spend all that money on the new license and then leave myself short. I'm glad I invested in the storeroom anyway. 
It's just a less convenient way to do it. Okay, I've got plenty of bread. Uh, let's move on. I need sugar. Oops. Water, cheese, coffee, and eggs. All over the floor, that's all right. There's another cheese shelf down there, I'll just top it up. Not by design. I wonder whether I should leave some, leave the fridge items out here. Just to keep them separate in organization. They can sit there in room temperature until they go off and that's fine. I'll never know that was me that got him sick. Afford a shelf of new stuff. It's four hundred dollars and it's without any stock. No, I think I think I just need to last another day. Boring, I know. Didn't buy any milk. Did I? that now. don't need the tea, I've got plenty, but I'll just grab a backup box. Okay, he's took up that milk. Beautiful. All nicely stocked. Could be a crazy person. Just follow customers around and restock the shelves behind them. I imagine that's what it's going to come to when I get two cashiers. Because it'll be my sole purpose in life. Keeping products on the shelves. the sugar. Thank you for clearing the shelf for me. Okay, 25.50. When's the uh, self-serve register update coming, I wonder? Here are the need needed cashiers altogether. So yeah, being early access, there are a few things that are sort of coming. So you can see here, customization is coming soon. Also, more employee types. So at the moment, you can only get cashiers, which is uh, a little bit annoying because I would love to have somebody else stocking the shelves for me. But it is what it is. The stage. So I wonder if I extend this back that's when this door becomes accessible. A locked door back there that I've just covered with a shelf. To serve. Thank you. No change.
What are people buying? Tea. The coffee. Yeah, I'm dreading how this is going to look when there's even more items to uh, <laughs> to worry about stocking. Master is going nuts. Got the water. Got the eggs. Cheese. Need to travel on there, newbie. I don't think I really need to buy anything at this stage. Oops. I don't know. I think. One dollar change. Oh, twins. Uh, four dollars. Definitely need to order some pasta. What else I actually need? Seems a waste to make an order just for pasta, but people want what the people want. Maybe my pasta is really cheap. Is it possibility? No, it's over market price. Okay, uh, nine dollars. No, people are just hungry for pasta. And you know what? I don't blame them. Take your time there, pal. He's gone to wait outside. There are four deep on that line, and I'm over here twiddling my thumbs. Come on, people. Come on. I know he's a beautiful man, but please. Ladies are just lining up. Just want to look at him, don't they? Don't be jealous. That's why I hired him. With stunning good looks. Over here, risen up all the young ladies. Can't blame him. Card thirteen. There we go. Ten to nine. Nearly done for the day. Again, passer is just flying out the door. That box. Here. Eighty seven change. Get out of my sight. All right. Nearly done. Coffee looking a bit bare up there.
wonder if there's a fast way to level up the store. Or is that literally buying the licenses and selling more products? It will help. So the sooner I level, the sooner I get another cashier. Alright, the rush is over. I'm going to end the day. $37. One product found expensive. I wonder what that was. In any case, good profit. Last bread has gone up in price. It's fine, we'll leave that there. Alright, let's have a look. Going to repay that loan. Going to pay these bills. Got thirteen hundred dollars. Basically used up all that stock from yesterday. Just about. Okay. Really, really wish I could. Um... Take the bread off that shelf. Drive me nuts. Didn't go away. Just want it off. Anyway, customers do me a dirty when I'm buying that bread. All right, here's what I'm gonna do. A bit of everything, once again. Make an absolute mess of the store. But I think I'm ready. I think I need to expand into other stock items. Sugar on the shelf. Beautiful. Oil, got plenty of oil. We didn't need to splash out another box, but anyway, it will get used. Not a tripping hazard at all. Don't even worry about it. Everything stopped, still got eleven hundred dollars. So, licenses. Bam. What have we got? Peanut butter. Flour. Olive oil. Spaghetti. Rice. And salt. Flour. Hold on, what's that then? Different flour. Bit of salt up there. I don't even know what this is. Let's go on there. Olive oil. Probably should have coordinated a little bit better. Peanut butter. Good to have you back. Bit of rice. Maybe I just need to vastly increase my prices so people can stop buying things.
And the ones that do, I'll just be making like 400% profit on. Damn it. Wish I planned ahead to keep all the spaghetti and the pasta together, keep all the oils together. Oh, I can't put that rice down yet because somebody has left all this bread on the shelf that I can't move. That's fine. Is that everything? One, two, three, four, five, six new products, yeah. I have money to spare. I might just even just fill that up there. Just because. I've got to set some prices. Spaghetti, market price is 660. Bam, seven. Rice, market value, 690. Bam, seven. Rice, market value, 678. Bam, seven. Market price, 270. Bam, seven. We'll get two. Five sixty-eight. Six. Peanut butter. Five forty. Mm, we'll go five. Right. All stocked up. I need some eggs and milk actually. Just to have. Milk and eggs, what else? What a box of pasta, two boxes of flour. Coffee, tea, I think I'm good, that might just do. Just to get everything as full as possible to start the day. Perfect. Alright, let's see how this goes. I'm just going to pop this out of the way and turn the light on now. Watch all these customers roll in. Look at them all. One. Anyway. While I'm waiting, I just want to see what the next expansion costs. Thirteen hundred. Which is a lot. But I think we need two at this stage. and would like to have twice the capacity in every shelf. So rather than just two lots of tea, we'll have four. I just don't have the room for that. I'm struggling to see how I'm going to have the visibility. Because as I said, I like to have my shelves facing me here so I can see at a glance, oh, I'm out of this, I'm out of that. Whereas if they're all aisles, I need to be running around checking. And uh, at this stage, if we've only got one cashier, that's going to be very difficult. Well, the good news is the new products are selling alright so far. Which is a positive thing. We're cooking now. some new bridges soon actually as well I was lucky that all the new stock today was only shelf stuff not bridge stuff or freezer stuff
Is that flower looking? Okay. This is good. Coffee. One. Customers. Just the cereal. Thank you, sir. Just the rice. Fourteen. Thank you very much. Sixty-five change. There you go. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, come again. So, what else do I need? I need to keep an eye on this new stuff. Ah, they're following me with that bread so I can start filling that shelf properly. Excellent. I just grab a new box of everything new. There, forty-eight dollars. Done. Bit of salt. Yes, ma'am. Fifty-two, fifty. Oops. Cool. Oh, coming to me. What am I paying you for again? Yes, ma'am. Tap change, thank you. Oh, Two fifty. Good. Need coffee. Okay. The good news is all these new products are taking the pressure off some of these old ones. We're not really stopping the same thing over and over. to buy some more coffee shortly. 36 50 thank you. Yep. 2250. Done. Flower. Everyone still loves the sugar. Okay, that's a big shop there. 48. Thank you. And that's why I try and keep all my prices either rounded or, you know, to the 50 cent because it just makes it so much quicker to key it through. I'm not really interested in sort of min-max pricing. I'm just sort of going thereabouts, whatever's easy and whatever's fair. Okay. 
No. Beautiful. So it's nine o'clock again. I think that probably does it for the day. Thirty nine satisfied customers. And a nice healthy balance. Cereal is down in price, sugar is up. Yeah, that's a drop. But we'll make it back in sugar. Beautiful. So that worked out okay. I might leave it there for this episode. So we finally achieved getting the next license and stocking six new products over here. Um, the next goal I think will be to expand again, get some more shelf space. And keep gunning for that store level 20 so we can get two cashiers on at the same time. Then I can focus all my attention on, on stocking, which would be fantastic. Um, but yeah, I'll leave it there. Thanks for watching. If you like this and want to stay up to date, please consider subscribing. It helps me out and then keeps you informed when new videos drop. And uh, if you have any feedback or suggestions for new games, please feel free to leave them in the comments. And I will do my best to get back to you every time. Thanks again. Once again, I'm Faintly Saintly and this is Supermarket Simulator. I'll see you next time.